I chose Catholic school because my mom and my two older sisters came to Sacred Heart and I came from a public school and I saw how Sacred Heart helped to further develop their faith. I've gone to Catholic school my entire life. I think that from a young age my parents thought it was important to further that relationship with God in school. I chose Catholic school because it was a better way to develop in my faith. I chose a Catholic school because I wanted to enrich my faith and grow with the school community. I chose Catholic school because I thought it would be a place that would allow me to further my relationship with God while being able to further my education. I love teaching, but I love teaching especially in a Catholic school because I can profess my faith. I want to be able to express what I believe and show the faith that Jesus has asked us to show to others. I enjoy teaching at a Catholic school because it allows for us to use the mission of the Sisters of St. Joseph. In our school's philosophy, every single part of God's creation is uniquely gifted. So no matter what happens in your life or you have hardships and trials that you face, you are always loved. He here at a Catholic school, we can practice our faith to thank God that Catholic schools provide the education that they do. Girls in high school come to learn, but also to grow. And being at Sacred Heart allows you to become who God created you to be. Having experienced that for myself, I wanted to be able to come here and give that to my students. Going to a Catholic all-girls high school definitely impacted my confidence in a positive way and encourages me to get involved in all school activities. It's definitely different than I would say going to a co-ed school. I see the difference between like just showing up however you want every day and you can see like the empowerment of all the girls. Going to an all-girls school, you're able to be a leader and not have anything hold you back. The girls can say what they need to say. They don't feel that they have to hold back. They taught me how to be a better person. The Shaw girls, they never cease to amaze me and how much I learn from them. Definitely made my best friends here. Everyone's very involved, making sure that you're okay and we'll definitely reach out to help you if you need something. The relationships I've formed with the faculty here is very special and unique to Sacred Heart. They're always available to help you and further your education. I was expecting to be a little left out being a transfer, but everyone was really welcoming and made me feel at home. Catholic school has really helped my faith to grow. Being able to be in an environment where faith is so important and faith is so central has allowed me to take the faith as my own and be able to say that I believe in God, I believe in Jesus, and being able to give that to those that I come into contact with every day has really been something that I couldn't have done without Catholic school. I believe Catholic education is so important in our country today. We need to be compassionate, open to everyone, willing to accept them for what they are, just as God has created them. Through our Catholic faith, we can show that. Whether you're Catholic or not, Catholic education just allows you to have that foundation of having some kind of faith-filled life. What makes Catholic education so different? We hold ourselves to a very high academic standard, but it's so much more than that, that we actually teach a child how to become a disciple of Jesus Christ. It benefits them to go out into the world and share that kindness. The world needs our kindness. It needs it. Our girls are up to the challenge. The mission of Sacred Heart is to lead with heart and encourage young girls to find compassion and confidence in everywhere they go and everything they do. Without faith, there is no, no basis for life. You have to believe in something. And believing in Jesus in our school is the basis of our education because he's told us where and what to do and how to do it. We practice it in our classrooms. Every year I was able to grow more into who I am today and a lot of that I owe to the teachers here at Sacred Heart. As a world language teacher, I want my students to remember that not only are we diverse and unique here in the United States, but the whole world is. And through learning another language, we can bring our faith, our love for God into other countries and other cultures. When they graduate, I'd like them to leave with compassion, honor, integrity, respect for themselves, respect for others, and perseverance. They don't know it yet. Not that they don't know it, it's the yet that, that's part of it, the perseverance piece. It's the compassion, the honor, uh, integrity, respect for each other, respect for themselves, and perseverance. I ask my students this all the time. I say, think of someone that you might not really like their actions or you might be in a room with them and it's the one person that uh, you can't stand and God is telling you to love that person as yourself and also to love those that society pushes down and suppresses. And that's a radical thing to ask, but it's a challenge that we're all meant to take. So I think that the most valuable lesson is to learn how to love. Don't be afraid to speak your mind, to speak up, to do your best, and also to share with the people out there. Again, we need such 
compassion in this world, but our girls go out there ready to share the inclusive love, the kindness, the unity, the reconciliation, to go out and share that with the world. And when I hear them doing that, and you know, I hear them doing excellent things in the world, we've done our jobs well. Just be true to who God created you to be. Don't be afraid to be yourself. Don't be afraid to be a woman who's going to lead with heart. And don't be afraid to be someone that is different than the crowd because we were all created to be unique and all created to be different. And there's nothing wrong with that. My name is Bernard Conway and I'm the director, editor, and producer of this documentary, Bonafide. In Latin, Bonafide translates to good faith. And I think that a huge reason people have a great faith is because of the Catholic education system they were rooted in. My roots in Catholic education go all the way back to St. Aidan's School in Wilston Park, New York. St. Aidan's gave me the background I needed to develop my faith. Sacred Heart Academy gave me the place I needed to grow in my faith. I can't fathom going into a place of learning where I can't profess my faith. There's nothing but love in a Catholic school, and I think that's something so important that they need in all schools. We feel comfortable enough to be able to talk about whatever's in our mind and what's ever in our hearts, and I think that's something that's really important that I value from my Catholic education. A lot of things happened to me in high school. I know that I would not have been able to get through them if it were not for the faculty at Sacred Heart Academy. Whatever I needed, they were there, no matter what. Being in a Catholic school, knowing that everyone was praying for me, knowing that all I had to do was walk into a teacher's office if I wanted to talk to someone. Having bad things happen to me in high school, without that pain and that sorrow, how would I know all the blessings I have in my life? And the truth is, Sacred Heart taught me to appreciate, I just the good things in life, but also the bad things, because the bad things are the things that allow you to grow and become stronger in your faith. Coming from a Catholic school, as a Catholic school kid, you have nothing to be ashamed of, and I think that you have everything to be proud of and should never be afraid to profess your faith. That's something I'll have forever, so thank you.